you so much for being here, Prashanti. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Yeah. Thank you. Um, wanted to hear your uh, idea of what is the key mindset uh, that you would like us to cultivate if we would journey through the civilizational path. Uh, see, what has happened is with uh, the advent of technology, social media. I think there's too much of noise uh, in the society. Uh, and the young generation, there's a lot of disturbance uh, uh, in concentrating to learn what they need to learn, what need. And somewhere we are moving away from uh, the thousands of years old uh, civilization. I think events like this uh, will eventually get, uh, gain more publicity. And uh, I think, see, we may be as modern and as uh, forward thinking as we are, but the roots should connect with the culture of Bharat. So that's my take. Um, would you like to tell us about five you know, lesser known places on India's map that is a treasure? I mean, there are many, but I'm sure it's difficult. But so, uh, yeah, so uh, I, uh, basically there are enough places uh, which I think we need to promote to see the actual architectural and uh, artistic value of the country. Mm -hmm. It's not only those five, six places where everyone visits. Mm -hmm. uh, they are very unknown, uh, remote places mm -hmm. uh, which are now there. And there are a lot of people who are now pop putting them onto the yes. uh, social media, knowing. And in fact, uh, I also have already put a few places which mm -hmm. I would like to visit whenever mm -hmm. I visit those places. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think there's no shortage of uh, Yes. Treasure in India, even a small, small, every small town has something which uh, speaks so much about the history and the uh, heritage and the culture of the country. Right. Wonderful. Thank you so much. Thank you.